In today's video, I'll be showing you how to scam people in Project Slayers. So you want to be a scammer? Well, you've come to the right place. Stay tuned as we dive into the world of scamming. I'll be showing you three ways to scam your victims. This first way of scamming involves you telling the person to lock the trade, but then right before you're about to trade you tell them, hey, by the way, I need some bandages, would you mind going and grabbing me some, and then we can make the deal. In doing so, once the person goes and gets you the bandages, hopefully they forget that their trade is locked, and then all you have to do to scam them is take your item out while they're going to get the bandages, and then lock your trade, and then... Congratulations, you've successfully scammed your first victim. Method number two. Method number two works best by overpaying a certain amount of ore for something. All you have to do for the scam to be successful is you want to make slight conversation. Then to put them at ease, you can ask them things such as, are you comfortable with this or are we ready to lock this trade? And then as fast as you possibly can make sure and your custom increment amount you have just one or less than whatever you're paying. For example, if you are trading 95 or you want to have 94 or and the custom increment amount that way, when you click the minus to decrease the amount of ore, it takes out all the ore except for one. That way the image does not change and does not cause other suspicion then once you've completed the trade congratulations you scammed your second victim method number three method number three is extremely similar to method number one just a different way to do it all you have to do is put the items in on both sides and then again you want to make slight conversation and ask if they are comfortable with this trade and if they are ready to make a deal once they lock their side you want to say hey wait could you come meet me i would really like to see your character and what it looks like come find me I'm over by blank, and doing so hopefully they will keep their trade locked and then as fast as you possibly you want to remove your items and lock the trade while they were looking for you. Hopefully they will be occupied enough not to notice that you have just scammed your third victim. Well that's all the tips I have for being a scammer. First of all I want to say, do not recommend scamming and I personally am not. A scammer, this is just ways that I've seen people do and try to do to me, and so I thought I'll make a video on it. I really hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe, if you have time or feel like doing so. Perfect.